Hey guys, welcome to another video with Walk With Leilani. We are on day two of Grinchmas. Today is already December 2nd. I cannot believe that it is here already. If you guys can see right here, I'm on day two of my Grinchmas 12 Cocos of Christmas. These are the 12 days of Grinchmas that I've been sharing with you guys. This is day two. Yesterday we did the French vanilla. I'm keeping the boxes so I can go over the ones that I did have already in case you guys missed the ones that I had. This one is for day two, which is the Amaretto. I do have it in here. Yesterday I did milk, but today I'm gonna be doing water because I don't want my stomach to get upset. I always tell people I'm a smidge lactose intolerant. I'm not 100% lactose intolerant, but I am a smidge lactose intolerant. So I don't wanna have too much milk on my stomach to kind of like irritate my stomach, you know what I mean? But I will be mixing this up so we can go ahead and chat a little bit how are you guys doing today let me know down in the comments how your december is starting off let me know there's a little bit of cocoa up here um let me know how your december is going so far how is december going for you guys so far let me know down in the comments how december is looking for you and kind of what you have going on on this very first weekend of December. What are you guys doing this weekend? Are you starting some Christmas shopping, finishing up Christmas shopping? Because believe it or not, some people are actually finishing up their shopping. It's crazy to me. I'm always very last minute with my shopping. I feel like I always end up doing well with my shopping, but I always end up doing like really last minute shopping. So let me know where you guys are in your shopping. Let me know. I think I'm probably next week which will be the first full week of December. I think I'm gonna start getting the stocking stuffers out the way. Um, as you guys know, I have older children. My daughter just turned 16 on the 27th of November. I can't believe that November is already gone and December's here, it's so wild. The year has truly flown by so fast. Um, my son is 22, he'll be 23 in January. His birthday is on January 9th. My birthday is January 23rd. So I'm excited about the new year. I will probably take down my Christmas decor probably a couple days after Christmas, close around the time of like New Year's Eve, New Year's Day. I'll probably keep it up till the end of December, most likely. And then I'll take it down and then I'll do like a Valentine's Day inventory. And then after I do the Valentine's Day inventory, I'll start putting up the Valentine's decor. I will do like a Valentine's Day kind of coffee cocoa bar. Um, my Nespresso coffee bar is now my second bar. I've had that area for about almost about a year there so now I do just a little bit over there as you guys saw in my past videos if you guys have not seen like some of the um videos that I've done for Christmas like decorating my kitchen doing my cocoa bar gingerbread inventory and things like that definitely go and check that out because I think you guys will be in for a treat if you guys want to see some decor and get some ideas inspiration tips or just to kind of you know have some fillers to like pass some time and things like that I do have that over there for you guys to be able to to be able to watch um in my videos what I say over there, so I mean. <laughs> so this one is the Amaretto, and you guys know it's one packet of cocoa mix with six ounces of hot water or milk. Stir until dissolved, and that is pretty much it. And this one is the Amaretto flavor, so I'm gonna go ahead and dive in to this. Doesn't that look delicious? I'm gonna go ahead and take a couple sips, and then I wanna kinda show you guys what I'm doing today, and that will be pretty much it for my 12 days of Grinchmas day what? Day two let's go ahead and jump in so first off i wanted to share with you guys this movie that i watched it's called the best christmas ever it's on netflix with brandy it's with heather graham which she's super funny brandy norwood jason biggs that's from american pie and when i tell you guys this movie is so good it says family movies kids and family movies it's a good movie it's fine for your kiddos to watch it's a really good movie. It's a brand new movie. Brandy Norwood is amazing. I actually went to junior high school with her. We actually went to junior high school from seventh through ninth grade. And then at the end of ninth grade, the second semester of ninth grade, I moved to another city. So I did not finish out. Um, but I did go to the same um, junior high as her. And this movie was an hour and 21 minutes in high def on Netflix. I definitely recommend you guys check it out. There's also another movie with Ludacris on Disney Plus with the actor Rail that played in the movie Get Out, if you guys saw the movie Get Out. That's another one that's supposed to be really good. I think Ludacris is playing kind of like a Grinch, but this movie was excellent. I'm definitely gonna have to watch it again. I was kind of baking a little bit while I was watching it. So let me show you guys what I'm baking and kind of what I got going on today. Okay, so as you guys know, today is the second day. It is the second day of December, which is my second day of my 12 days of Grinchmas. Now it's getting sunny outside. See how it's brightening up now? And it's like, okay, I don't even need light because look how bright it's looking right now. Like 
this is the energy I need. It's like when it gets dark in here, it's dark in here and it's really bad. I'm actually cleaning kitchen. I'm actually trying to get these cookies going. Um, I want to get the sugar bread cookies going because I promised my family these the other day and I didn't make them. So I'm putting the, the dough together now. So the dough is in the fridge. You guys can see I have the whisk here and the spatula. Now the sun's going away again. So the next thing I'm going to do is take this vanilla Pillsbury frosting and put it inside of this piping bag. And that is what I'm going to use to actually decorate my cookies. And I have to let it be in the refrigerator. The, the shortbread cookie dough has to be in the refrigerator for 30 minutes before you actually are able to like, you know, bake the cookies and stuff, roll them out and make them. So here's my mixing bowl. I'm about to wash that out. I'm washing makeup brushes over here. I got clean wrap. I got dishes, you guys. I'm doing all kinds of stuff today. My husband is just now starting to go outside and get things together for what? Putting up the decor outside. And what else? Putting up the tree. I didn't show you guys the tree area because I told you guys today is the magical day to put things up. You guys will probably see a little snippet of that at the end of this video, but I will definitely be sharing it with you guys on day three, which will be tomorrow on Sunday. So another thing, since it's so funny that I'm doing Grinch Miss, here is the Grinch Vanilla. It's called the Grinch Frosted Sugar Cookie. Actually, I take that back, Vanilla. It's called the uh, Grinch Frosted Sugar Cookie International Delight. This is the cookie creamer. It's pretty good. I mean, it's very light in flavor, if I'm being honest with you, but it's pretty decent. Um, here is the sugar cookie mix. It looks like tortillas, but it's, it's I keep saying sugar cookie, you guys. It's shortbread. Shortbread cookie. The, fr the, um, <laughs> the creamer is a frosted sugar cookie creamer, but these are shortbread cookies, and I have to let it thaw for 30 minutes. So that's why it's in the fridge like that. And the reason why it's wrapped up like that is because that's what was requested. It was requested for it to be wrapped up that way. So that's why I have that like that. So in the midst of that, I'm just in my kitchen and I'm just kind of doing some things, getting ready, getting some things organized, washing some dishes and stuff like that. Um, definitely stay tuned to the end of the video so you guys can get an idea, a little glimpse of, you know, what I'm kind of doing, putting, putting the tree up. My husband's doing a little bit of decor outside. Um, not a little bit of decor, but he's doing the decor outside. You guys will get a little snippet of it um, at the end of this video, but definitely on day three, when I will be indulging in this hazelnut call, <laughs> hazelnut um, hot cocoa, you guys will definitely see a lot more of the tree. You guys will be able to see the decor outside. That basically will be what I share with you guys on Sunday. So until then, I hope that you guys are having a great start to your December. I hope you guys are enjoying the 12 days of Grinchmas. I will be back for a total of 12 great, 12, 12 days total is what I will be doing for the 12 days of Grinchmas, obviously, right? So day two is going pretty well. I will talk to you guys later. I will see you guys on day three. Have a good one. Bye.